wicked, wicked people. Oh my goodness. Ladies and gentlemen, we are two weeks out from one of the biggest games, I would say the biggest game of the year. That is correct. I would say it's bigger than Baldur's Gate 3, Final Fantasy 16, Starfield. The game of the year is Spider-Man 2. I think we all know this, all right? I have my money on it winning game of the year, but that is yet to be seen. We are two weeks out from, from launch, and there are a group of people, wicked, wicked, evil people, all right? Or as I like to refer to them as, gameless goblins. Nevertheless, these gameless goblins, also known as Xbox uh, players, they are going on a rampage, a tirade of spoiling Spider-Man 2. Now, I don't know what to tell you, what type of demonic, demonic, evil, wicked type of behavior that is. That is evil. That's just in a nutshell, that's what that is. That's like the people who, to, who try to spoil a movie, right? There was people who were trying to spoil Endgame. There's people who are trying to spoil Avengers. There's a, there are people out there that just want to watch the world burn. And they definitely want to watch the world burn if they have no games. That's all you can do is just watch everyone else play. So, eh. And these people just want the worst of the worst for everyone, including themselves. Now, I just want you to understand that these individuals don't have to be like that. You don't have to be an Xbox user with no games. There is salvation for you. That is correct. You can actually play Spider-Man 2 in two weeks. Mm-hmm. You don't have to be salty because I've heard that these people are going in people's DMs and messaging them spoilers. That's, bro, <laughs> that cold, bro. That is cold. Messaging people spoilers about the biggest game of the year. That's just wicked. And I want you to know you can be saved. You don't have to be a gameless goblin for all of your life, for all of your gaming career. You can actually be saved. And the way you can do it is actually, uh, PlayStation is so kind that they, I believe they've included uh, a Spider-Man 2 copy within the bundle of Spider-Man, uh, of, of PlayStation PS5, okay? And if you don't wanna do that, well, I'm sure there's PlayStation 5 that you can now acquire. I know years ago, even heck, even months ago, you couldn't get a, a PlayStation 5 if you wanted to. You had to sell a kidney, an arm, a newborn. I understand. Times have changed, and you don't have to be a gangless goblin, okay? You can join the rest of society, of civilized society, because I've seen how you Xbox lives, all right? I've seen it. It's, it's disgusting. It's disparaging. It's sad. It sickens my heart. It's like a third world gaming community, all right? <laughs> they still getting updates for Redfall. Well, look, we got a, we got a performance update. Huh? All jokes aside, and those weren't jokes, I think we can all come together and, and call a truce, okay? Because I don't see anyone spoiling Starfield. What was there to spoil? I don't know. The game was bona fide trash. I think we can, can we agree on that? Or are people still trying to post out videos? Oh wow, look at this quest. This quest is so mind blowing. This is why Starfield is the game of the generation. Okay, coping. That's what that is. That's, that, that's called coping. Now, I think we can all come together as a community, as a gaming community, some of us with games, some of us without games, but nonetheless, you know, uh, uh, fans of games all together, and we can come out with the truce, all right, of not spoiling games for people, because that's really evil. People spend years and years and years of their life putting work into these games, and we as a community spend years and years waiting for sequels, right, in some cases. Uh, some cases longer than others. Imagine someone coming out and trying to spoil Grand Theft Auto 6. I, I, it's just, that's wicked behavior. So I think we can all respect one another and not spoil games for people, especially people who actually want to play the game. If you're just a casual and this is like another game, fine, then be, then be that person. But for some of us, we actually enjoy the game. We're actually passionate about characters and certain IPs and certain franchises. Just be, just be respectable. Just have a certain decorum um, when it comes to, to, to games. I, I don't think that's, you know, I don't think that's hard. We, we can agree and disagree, but when it comes to spoiling games, going in people's DMs, messaging them, when it comes to adding people, because I've seen people do that, at people 
Uh, that's why you always want to know why my DMs are usually closed and you can't at me because when it comes around to releases, that's what people do. I have to, you know, be careful on YouTube because people are, you know, spoiling Assassin's Creed. We're like, hey, this is the final boss. And it's like, I understand if you want to put final boss, but then they actually put a picture of the final boss in the thumbnail. I'm just like, you guys are just, just wicked, wicked, evil people. You gameless goblins. And that's not to say all of you, okay? That's not to say it was the gameless goblins that did this. But you know what I'm talking about. You all are part of the, the you know, birds of a feather flock together. So if you don't want Spider-Man 2 spoiled, I suggest you go on a full blackout, all right? That's the only thing that I see being feasible moving forward. Now, I also have to give my little two cents about them releasing the codes two months in advance. What were you guys thinking? Are you guys retarded, Insomniac? Are you guys retarded, Sony? That is dumb. You guys went on complete silence for years for the most part. No gameplay, no gameplay, little trailer, little, little trailer. And then you come out and give us a gameplay and then you give out review codes almost a month in advance for the most anticipated game out there? What are you guys thinking? That's unheard of. I'm sorry, that's unheard of. Usually, like max is usually maybe three weeks, two to three weeks before the game. I just don't see how they are giving out review codes this early. I get people are talking about, well, that's a sign it's a great game. I get that. You can also be confident in your game and not be a detriment to the entire community. You know somebody's gonna spoil it. You know, you know gameplay, getting close to it, someone's gonna spoil it. You know it is, or they're gonna try. If you're so confident in this game, then you should be confident in the security around this game. And I know you, you can put out posts, hey, don't spoil the game, don't spoil it. Bro, they're gameless goblins. These are demons out there. And they're not gonna listen to that. I don't think much of them can read. I, it just is what it is. I'm not a big fan of that, but you know, that's probably not Insomniac's decision, that's probably Sony's decision. So just, just be safe out there, y'all. Just be safe. Anyways, guys, that's the video. Let me know what you guys think, whether or not you believe, look, 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 say, they're doing fine, okay? They don't need your advice, all right? They know what they're doing, okay? If you don't want to see the leaks, then don't look at them. It's as simple as that. Or if you have to leave, listen. If it was that simple, that'd be great. But unfortunately, there are wicked people out there that even though you may actually avoid spoilers, all it takes is one D-bag to put in a comment section of a video you're watching under an iGen video, a GameSpot video, ACG or whatever. That's all it takes. So you have to, don't ever underestimate the wickedness of people, okay? Don't do that. Nevertheless, if you happen to disagree with this video or any other video, mind you, uh, well, you're in luck because today is disagreement day. And disagreement days are typically held Friday through Sunday. There'll be a number on screen and call in, we duke it out. Either or, Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please feel free to like, comment, uh, subscribe, uh, share, all that fun stuff. Until next time, guys, be amazing. Wicked, wicked, evil people.